Okay, Ninja, so it's time also to test the rules of survival on Helio P70, Realme U1. Uh, also, I'm going to test it on maximum graphics. Excellent. FPS settings ultra, shadow settings high. There you go, Ninjas. Everything is on maximum. Let's go. What? Ah, okay, okay. Here we go, Ninjas. We are in the game rules of survival. Not bad so far, but we're going to see on the ground. 56, let's jump. Not bad, bro. Not bad, Helio P70. It's a surprise there for Android games, but yet again, uh, I'm talking so positive. Uh, didn't even yet check the test the PUBG. We'll have to check the PUBG. So so far, I'm satisfied. They're running Asphalt 9 at the max graphics, really good. NBA 2K19 also not bad at all. Thought it's gonna lag there a lot, but it doesn't lag a lot, bro. Anyway, I'm gonna stay with the rules of survival for now. There we go. There we go. No, I don't need a bow, man. What is that? There's a bow. <laughs> okay. Not bad, running really good. Oh, take that. And add that. This is what I need, bro. Oh, what is what do we have here? Oh, again. Take this one also, bro. Okay, max volume. Not bad at all, bro. <laughs> oh. I mean, it's not running right uh, like 60 FPS, but it's about 30 FPS for sure, bro. It's like 45 or so, bro. Sometimes you will probably get 60 FPS, but not constantly, bro. Very impressive, bro, for this Mediatek SoC. Hmm, what are we gonna, shall I take this one? I'm gonna stay with these ones. Let's jump. Oh, what a kill, bro. Another kill. What is cool about the Halo P70 Ninjas that it doesn't overheat, bro. It doesn't overheat those critical ones, but at least with these games that I tested so far, it, it doesn't overheat. It does get warm, uh, almost close to the 40 degrees, but that's very impressive, man. I mean, that's normal, and that's this is completely acceptable. As, uh, as long as it doesn't overheat like 44, 45 degrees. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, somewhere. The weapon which I ha am having is so powerful, bro. Like you, like you see by yourself, this is not 60 FPS ninjas, this is like under 45 or so, something like that. Sometimes you do get like a 60 FPS, right now this is 60 FPS. Or let's say this moment here, this is 60 FPS when I'm looking here at half sky, half ground. But as soon as I'm moving here like horizontally like this, looking this guy a little bit in the road, uh, then it goes below 60 FPS, bro. Check it out, ninjas. Beautiful rules of survival is getting check it out man. This is such a realistic sky Such a realistic sky. You have to admit that The only thing what is not realistic about this Sky that is not moving bro, and this is where PUBG wins bro. They even rendered the sky on PUBG That's why the PUBG is the most realistic game uh, on Google Play Store at least the ones which are the most popular so, uh, right now This one the sky is not moving at all it looks so realistic, but it's not moving, bro. 
Anyway, let me see first how my, how long I'm playing this game. Uh, oh my God, ninjas! So I'm gonna play ten minutes more, and it's gonna be one hour since I'm playing. Oh my God, one hour playing game on Realme U1. I thought I'm gonna play it just half hour, but I'm playing one hour. Nuts, bro. So I'm gonna play. Uh, I'm gonna right now just pause the video because uh, my back are hurt. Hurt, but it's just they hurt. <laughs> Uh, one hour playing games on the studio table is really painful. So I'm gonna just pause the video and we're gonna see each other in a few minutes, bro. Okay, stay tuned. Yep, no weapons there, just frying pan. Also remember that the sound speaker is around 80%, 85%. There you go. 85 so or so. I uh, been using it uh, exactly the same on other smartphones also. So trying to be a fair play as much as I can in just uh, remember that also this is my second time I'm testing the battery here regarding the gaming with the Realme U1 uh, U1 here and the Halo P70. I already done it with the different games at the max graphics and I got around 4 hours screen on time in just I played uh, uh, I played NBA. I played Mob uh, Le Mobile Legends. Oh oh oh! He's gonna he's gonna run after me now. Need to find my. There you go there you go. Come on come on bro. But come on bro, what you doing? What look this idiot here bro. He should help me and he's running away. I'm gonna go into the sea. I'm going into the sea, bro. I don't think we can attack each other in the water. <laughs> oh! Ah, oh, he can! <laughs> okay, and in just third attempt, let's check here first the temps. Uh, on the end, if I don't forget, I'm gonna test also the thermals using the Aida 64. 39, and I think it's gonna stay at 39. The maximum I got is 40, and that's a really great spot there. Uh, this smartphone doesn't overheat. Uh, these uh, normal, and I also did test the AGR, but you know what, I'm gonna... I'm, Wait for the heating test in my uh, in my different gameplay where I'm gonna test also the HDR mode, ninjas. Because right now this is not an HDR, so maybe it's not fair play to test the heating test. Again, on HDR, most of the smartphones, like 90% of the smartphones, 90% of the SOCs will overheat, ninjas. Remember that they will go above 40 degrees. Uh, such a beautiful, such a gorgeous smartphone, Ninjas. Do you see this teardrop? This is like a three times cheaper OnePlus 6T, bro. Remember, remember, remember that OnePlus 6T also has this exactly same design. Same design, bro. Okay. Any weapon here, bro? Come on now. No weapon whatsoever. Whatsoever. Don't tell me it's again the same. Somebody's running after me, but I, I think I think I killed that dude. Yeah, I did. I have one kill already. One kill, one kill. I think somebody's after me. 
No, nobody's after me, bro. Good. Good, good, good. Let me just lay down and use the health. So ninjas, you do get 60 FPS, but it's not constant, ninjas. You, it's not constant with the Halo P70 at these. Uh, I can say for sure that this is low graphics, ninjas. Balance mode, HD resolution, no shadows. We can say that this is, of course, it's not the lowest uh, settings, lowest graphics, but it's low, ninjas. If they've been announcing this one, uh, at least those Indian YouTubers saying that this is a main range, mid range SOC, this is a disappointment. In my opinion, this is a disappointment because Snapdragon 660, uh, Snapdragon 710 easily can give you uh, HDR with the uh, with the 60 FPS ninjas. Uh, again, not not the uh, not basically not uh, uh, on uh, full HD and the shadows. But you know what? Because this is a new update, I will have to test it again with the Snapdragon 710. And of course, I do have a Snapdragon 710 in my hands. That's the Xiaomi Mi 8 SE. But so far, uh, honestly, you will see that it's uh, 660, Snapdragon 710, generally, in all Android games, are faster bro, than this device over here. Again, uh, I, I have to be like kind of a fair play or maybe uh, understandable a little bit. This is a new SoC, this is a new processor. And probably these uh, games are not yet optimized for this SoC. This is what the uh, fanboys would say. So again, I want I want to please a little bit the fanboys also. Just a little bit, just a little bit, man. You see, if you look like this, this is not 60 FPS. If you look like this, this is 60 FPS, man. As soon as you go here and look, this is not 60 FPS, bro. This is like 45, maybe. Here you go, and here, this is not 60 FPS, bro. No chance. This is this is 60 FPS. Anyway, also this is 60 FPS. Okay, they are. Oh, uh, let me use my drinking energy. Drink. Okay, let's go. Oh, one well, minute with my team, bro. Let's go with my team over here. Boom. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Nice kill. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Where next? Oh, there you go, there you go. We have another one. Oh, he killed me, bro. What the hell? What is this? What is this one? Ah. Oh, good, good. They're gonna save me. Oh, <laughs> good, good. See, it's better to stick together, man. Okay, we're gonna test again the temps. So you can see by some ninjas, it doesn't go above forty degrees so far with these settings. But of course, for the full judgment, you're gonna have my other video where I'm gonna test different settings uh, with the GFX tool for the uh, Realme U1 Halo P70. I repeat again, ninjas, this is HD resolution without the shadows. This is not impressive performance for a, a so-called mid-ranger. This is not a good performance. I mean, of course, it's good for the uh, people who who already bought or who want to buy the Realme. They can obviously, you could play the PUBG here with these settings smoothly here. But I expected more, ninjas. I expected more. I have to admit that the other games like uh, Asphalt 9... NP 2K19 on max graphics do run good. I was uh, overwhelmed. But it seems that this new update also brought down performance even for the flagship smartphone. So maybe this new update is not uh, great for me to even do this testing, uh, this gaming test. But how else? How else am I going to do, man? I can't uninstall and use the uh, older update because it's impossible. They will ask me to update the PUBG immediately.
Oh, what a sucker. He died. <laughs> he died, bro. He killed himself. <laughs> so two players left, or one player left, I think. So one player left. Oh, no, that good... What what what's happening man? Why are they Oh I survived somehow. And win win man. Chicken chicken dinner dinner win win Have you ever wondered where to buy smartphones from Chicken Chicken Ching 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 China? That is the gearbest.com and banggood.com, the most reliable two sites for online buying. Use my promo links below in the description to purchase anything ninjas. That's the best way to support me. Let's go!